you to the library. It's a place where I love to be. Look in a book, here's a story for you. Who makes stories when the day is through? Who makes stories when the day is through? Story makers, story makers. Working through the night till the rising sun. Story makers, story makers. Stories are fabulous, stories are fun. Byron Wordsworth. Working through the night till the rising sun. Story makers, story makers. Stories are fabulous, stories are fun. Come and be a story maker. Come on, everyone, it's time to go home. It's midnight in the library. Hello. Time for all story makers to come out. Are you ready? The sun is down, the stars are bright. Story makers come out at night. Hi, story maker. I'm Byron. Byron Wordsworth. Here to make some magic and lots of stories. Ooh. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm kind of hungry. <laughs> story makers can't work on an empty tummy. <sighs> so, it's time for a snack. You fancy a sandwich snack? <laughs> yes. The man in the suit says abracazoo. <sighs> mm -mm. Now, what shall I have on my sandwich? Ah, I'm feeling kind of sweet tonight, so... Honey, I think. <laughs> oh, hello, Byron. <laughs> oh, you're making a sandwich. That's right. You fancy some? <gasps> oh, yes, please. Um, can I have crunchy salad, please? Coming up. Mm. So that's... Honey. Mm. Mm. And uh, crispy salad. Uh, mm, mm. Mm. Oh, oh, Byron, that's a big sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> and it's growing. Sure can, my princess. And yeah. uh, what would you fancy? Um, uh, oh, I know. Um, jelly beans. Jelly? Yeah. Jelly beans. Jelly. What? Oh, nothing. <laughs> jelly beans. <laughs> yeah. Jelly beans. Yeah, yeah, right. jelly beans. Yeah. Abracazoot. Oh. Uh, hmm. <laughs> right. So, that is honey, mm. crispy salad. Yeah. And, and jelly, jelly beans. beans, yeah. Uh, jelly beans. Byron, mm. uh, this is going to be a, a, a very um, unusual sandwich. Mm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And you know what this sandwich needs? What? what? Cheese. <laughs> you can't beat cheese for sandwiches. Cheese. 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 Cosmic. <laughs> Yeah, I think I feel a story coming on. Oh, we could eat our sandwich while we make the story. <laughs> yeah, yeah, um, but I only wanted a jelly bean sandwich. Oh, yeah, mm. and I only wanted a crispy, mm. crunchy salad sandwich. Hey, no problem. Oh. <laughs> Abracazoot. Oh! oh. oh. Ah, look, a jelly bean sandwich for me. And a crispy, oh. crunchy salad for me. <laughs> And a cheese sandwich for me. <laughs> and that just leaves the honey sandwich left over. Ah, that must be the one to make the story with. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, well actually, Byron, mm -hmm. yeah, uh, I was only joking about the jelly bean sandwich. Oh, really? Mm. Yeah. Mm. Uh, I would rather have the honey one, yeah. No problem. Okay. You have the honey sandwich, yeah. and the jelly bean sandwich makes the story. Oh, uh, <laughs> thank you, Byron. <laughs> One story-making sandwich for the machine. And now we need just one more special ingredient. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Your imagination. Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. 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 Imagine. 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 
Imagine a story. I can't wait to eat my sandwich. Oh, me too. <laughs> oh, it's a playbook. And it's called Tiana's Tea Party. Tiana was having a very busy day. Her friend Teddy was coming round for tea later, and there was lots to do. First of all, she had to make the house. And put up the doorbell. Once the house was ready, Tiana found a table. And set plates, and cups, and saucers, and a teapot. And then she set to work making some sandwiches. Just then, she heard the doorbell ring. It was Teddy. Hello, waved Tiana. Tiana poured the tea. And had to help Teddy to her sandwich as her paws were a bit stiff. Mmm, yum, yum. Just then, there was another ring at the door. Who could that be? thought Tiana. It was Mum, carrying a tray of real cakes and tea. Room for one more? asked Mum. Tiana gave everyone a cake. drank her warm mug of tea and had the best party ever. Oh, didn't Tiana have a lovely tea party? Yeah, I, I hope mm. Teddy's sandwich was as yummy as mine. Yeah, yeah but, but Jackson, I would want to have a tea party outside. Oh. Yeah, yeah, then we could have a picnic. Really? Mm, yeah, yeah, and guess who I would invite? Oh. <laughs> Thank you, Jelly. Because you... then you could help me. Oh, mm. thanks. Yeah, mm. you can help me get things ready. Just one thing, Jelly. Mm? What are we going to get ready? Oh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I haven't thought about that. Right. Well, it's a good thing I'm helping then, isn't it? Yeah. Well, funnily enough, <laughs> the children were playing with a picnic hamper earlier today. <laughs> ah, Look. Wow. Mm. With, with plates and... Sauces and cups yes, and Yes, it's got everything. And... Mm. Oh, wow. and look, it's even got a nice tablecloth to put things on. Oh, mm. yeah. <laughs> and, oh, and little plates. Little look. plates too, look. Yes, I like and those. little. Yeah. One for all of us. One for Byron, there, green one. Mm -hmm. And one for me, a blue one. And mm. one for you, Jelly, <laughs> a red one. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, no, no, but there's one left over. Oh, don't worry. No problem, as Byron would say. We can use it to make a story. <laughs> oh, yeah, clever, Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> one plate for a story. <laughs> I knew you'd be helpful, Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> Will you help too? Yes. Yeah. Imagine. 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 Imagine a story. Mm. Oh, come on, story machine. <laughs> oh, it's a rainforest story. Oh, good. And it's called Proud Bird's Soup. Deep in the forest, there are stories to tell of froggy, snake, bird, and monkey as well. Stir the pot. <laughs> oh. 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 oh, this soup is good. This soup is fine. Nobody makes soup as fine as mine. Should I share it? Oh, what a waste. All of my friends have such terrible taste. 
greedy snake would eat the lot. Does he deserve it? No, he does not. Then, this cheeky froggy, she's quite sweet, but she'd jump in with both her feet. And look who's here, monkeying around. <laughs> Monkey had guessed he's safe and sound. Oh, hello, bird. What are you doing? What's this stuff that you've been brewing? <gasps> brewing? Monkey, how could you be so rude? Sorry, bird. It does look good. Please, if I may, could I taste your food? <laughs> Certainly, Monkey. Have a taste, but don't drip a drop. Don't you dare waste. Monkey's tongue gave a rumbling sound. He tried to lift the pot, but it was wedged into the ground. It wouldn't move a jot. <laughs> I see you've lost your appetite. <laughs> Just let me have your share. <laughs> Oh, that smells so very good. This really isn't fair. Psst, monkey, over here. Proud bird has tricked you. That much is clear. Oh, why not try to foil her too? Here is what you have to do. <laughs> Dear bird. <laughs> You've been so very kind. Come and share some soup with me. Monkey, thank you. I wouldn't mind. <laughs> Monkey placed two plates down, side by side. The plates were no good for Bird. They were far too flat and wide. She tried to drink as best she could. But her beak was the wrong shape. It was no good. <laughs> Come on, bird. Drink your fill. What's the matter? Are you ill? <laughs> Not a drop could proud bird taste. Oh. Let me have it then. It's far too good to waste. He was very cheeky, wasn't he? Oh, yeah, he's very cheeky. <laughs> Hi, Princess. Hi, Bonnie. Hey, Jack. <laughs> you know, that story machine sure knows how to pick a good story. Yeah. <laughs> very funny, Byron. <laughs> so? You said pick. Yeah, yeah I did. Pick. Nick. Yeah. Oh. yeah. And, Byron, <laughs> I wanted you to come. Oh, <laughs> I'd love to. <laughs> you know what you have at a picnic? Sausage rolls yeah, and, yeah, and, and jam sandwiches and, cheese, and, and biscuits. And, and, yeah, 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 yes, yes, yes. But I wasn't just and, talking about food, you two. Oh. Yeah. We're having a picnic. Mm. We're in the countryside. Mm. Yeah. And what do you hear? Um, oh, um, the birds. <laughs> in <yeah>. one. <laughs> oh. Tweet, 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 tweet. Uh, there's something else you get at a picnic. Uh, what? What is it? <laughs> oh, oh, Rain. <laughs> we better get a move on. Yeah. Uh, I can feel a story coming on. <gasps> what shall we use to make it? I know. Oh, I know. We can use the tablecloth. <laughs> Quantum. <laughs> right. Stand back. Abra kazoo. <laughs> One picnic cloth for a story. And we need your imagination. Are you ready? Imagine. Imagine. Imagine a story. Ah. Ooh, it's Blue Cow. <laughs> and it's called Blue Cow and the Spaghetti. In a field not far away is a herd of cows grazing quietly. One of the cows is most unusual. Blue Cow wonders, wonders about the big world beyond her field. 
One day, Blue Cow was looking at the other cows eating grass. I wonder what else you can eat. She's off again, said the other cows. So, Blue Cow caught the bus that stops beside her field. I'd like a ticket to a place where I can eat something other than grass, please. There you go, madam. Hold very tight. And they set off for Italy. And then they arrived. In front of Blue Cow, there was an enormous pan of spaghetti. Next to it were two wheelbarrows. One was full of tomatoes, and the other was full of blueberries. Oh, mamma mia! cried a small Italian man. He was squashing tomatoes with a wooden spoon. As soon as the villagers will arrive, and nothing is ready. Hello, I'm Blue Cow. Can I help? Oh, thank you. I'm a Mario Pasta. I have to squash all of the tomatoes for the spaghetti sauce, and then the blueberries for a blueberry drink. Non c'è tempo. There is no time. Oh, 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 I've got an idea. Blue Cow covered all the tomatoes with a tablecloth and splat! Oh. She sat on them. Oh, brava! <laughs> oh, brava tomato sauce for the spaghetti! <laughs> now for the blueberry drink! She covered them with another tablecloth. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> ah, si, si. <laughs> Buono! <laughs> said Mario, and he pushed one of the wheelbarrows towards the spaghetti. Moo, wait! cried Blue Cow. That's the wrong one! Too late. He tipped blueberries into the spaghetti. <laughs> it turned blue. Ooh. Oh no! And here come the villagers! <laughs> sobbed Mario. <laughs> they cried. Hey, the blue spaghetti! Well done, the Blue Cow! <laughs> laughed Mario. Oh, we shall call it a Blue Cow Spaghetti after you! <laughs> oh, thank you! Said Blue Cow, slurping up a piece of the spaghetti. Ooh, yummy! You'll never guess where I've been. Where have you been? I've been to Italy and eaten blue spaghetti. Everyone knows that cows can't go to Italy and eat spaghetti. But we know they can, don't we? <laughs> well, funny blue cow eating blue spaghetti. <laughs> I think I would like to try blue spaghetti. Yeah, <laughs> Mm. Oh, no time for spaghetti. Oh. Time to skedaddle. Mm. Oh, is it time to go already? Mm. Oh, yes, Jelly. Mm. The children will be here soon. Yeah. Dawn is upon us. Mm. The morning is now. We've made our stories and we bid you <laughs> good goodbye. goodbye. <laughs> Story makers, story makers, working through the night till the rising sun. Story makers, Come back story soon. makers, stories Bye. are fabulous, stories Thanks are fun. Thanks for helping. Bye. See you later, story maker. <laughs>